long for this moment, little spider. To squash you here, in this cursed place. When you are gone, we shall feast upon your new friend heroes. And then, <laughs> devour your precious Mary Jane. Hey, Eddie. I know that's just Lilith talking through you or whatever, but shut up already! I'm back, ready for more. Light will carry you onward. Aw, that's thoughtful. That will not slow me down. Another batch of idiots coming in. Your web is broken, little spider. Your trap has failed! He may be right. This symbiote sample is not worth your life, Spider-Man. We can find another way. Tell that to Aunt May, Mary Jane, Harry, Flash, Felicia, Otto, and about nine million other New Yorkers we're trying to save. If getting that sample means we can stop your mother from destroying this city, it's worth the risk. Just buy me some time. Come on, Eddie, just give it up already. How about we hit up that Chinese buffet over in Bushwick? My treat! All the food we need is right in front of us! Mother Count! 
this up forever. But we can. Do you really think your puny bell of tin can defy the power of the Midnight Sun? Don't forget arsenic, lead, zinc, and silver. Seventh grade trip to the Liberty Bell. numbers won't save you now.
Your time has come! Pain is angering! Pathetic attempt at intimidation. They have an answer for this. Do you justice? left a residue.
this one's for you. You have my thoughts. The strongest has fallen, but the fight remains. We've got it! Let's do this! of ours, Eddie. Think it's time we change it up. So how about we try a little smash-up? What? That... not a thing anymore? Let's find out. Now this might sting for just a second, but that's perfectly natural. Fury's got two teams digging for Venom as we speak. He may want to add two or three more. Just saying. You dropped a church on him. I doubt he's going anywhere. Parker? Uh-oh. I have seen that look before. Congratulations. On a job well done. Aw, thanks everyone. I'll remember this moment forever. Which is probably how long it's gonna take me to pay the church's repair bill. Oh, not to worry. Thankfully, we have a billionaire in the house. Yeah, at least Stark's credit card is good for something. Oh, these kids. Real sweethearts. Good plan, Peter. Executed like a champ. Craziest plan I ever saw in my life. Still can't believe he pulled that off. Yes, and now we must make use of the sample he recovered. Um, we? All right, everyone. I know you all have a lot more important things to do than cheer little old me on. Let's go save the world. Oh! And if anyone happened to record any of this, feel free to send it my way. For training purposes, of course. From what I've seen, you could drop five churches on Venom and he'd still keep coming. I doubt we've seen the last of him. Just between you and me, I wasn't 100% sure that little plan would pay off out there. I mean, I was pretty sure, but I still had that little voice in the back of my head. If you screw this up, Venom's gonna be snacking on your skull! Even worse, I would've let you down, not to mention the others. I always knew you would succeed, Peter. Enjoy the praise you received. Thanks. It's kinda nice to be the man of the hour. Even if it only lasts... Uh, an hour. Spent so long trying to keep Spider-Man and Peter Parker separate from each other, I never really had the chance to celebrate victories with... you know... Friends? Exactly. Thank you for that, Hunter. However you look at it, be glad we got the sample. Now we can get the dock home, keep you less explodey? All around, a good day. We all owe you a thanks. I was nothing. Besides, helping the boss man test his top-secret prototype on a demonically-possessed alien-symbiote-human hybrid has got to look good to the folks at Stark Industries. Would love to get a shot to work for Tony one day. Just wish Spider-Man could submit a resume. But you are working with Tony, Peter. You are an integral member of the team. Whoa. Mind just... Peter? Nope. Mind still blown. 
I just need to sit here and let it all sink in, Hunter. I'll, uh, I'll talk to you soon. Parker's plan was chaotic, but effective. I doubt even Lilith saw that one coming. Parker's debrief is going to be one for the ages. I think I ticked off Captain Marvel, and wow, that is nothing I expected to say in my lifetime. What happened? She caught me bringing an armload of snacks to my room, asked if I was hoarding food. She was joking, but kind of not joking. I haven't lived with people outside of family. Am I doing it wrong? Do, do I write an apology note, or how do I fix this? Did you often raid the pantry when you were living at home? Not really. I'd grab an extra fruit pie now and again, but I just took what I needed. Then pretend you are at home. That should be easy. Caretaker is a scary version of my aunt. I should get a picture. I can't wait to show this to MJ. start actually listening to us for a change. That looks good. Yay! You pulled off the impossible mission again surprising nobody at all still reading Wanda's grimoire I see yeah why you got an opinion about it I admire your determination in your pursuit of dark knowledge as well as loyalty to your friend Ugh, I just wish there was more dark knowledge on these pages but I'm, I'm just gonna have to make do with what's here According to her grimoire, it looks like Agatha was helping Wanda control her connection to chaos magic. And since chaos magic is a hell of a lot more powerful and ancient than Lilith, I'm thinking there's a way I can figure out how to use it to undo Lilith's hold on her. Chaos magic is the darkest and most treacherous magic you can play with. It is said to come from Cathan himself. If you are planning on dabbling in it, you will need my help. Uh, you're not, like, afraid of messing with hardcore Elder God magic and inventing a potentially dangerous new spell? I am dangerous. Okay, danger. You can help me by not telling Caretaker what I'm up to. She doesn't believe Lil and Corruption can be undone and will totally try and stop me. She lacks your imagination. <laughs> she lacks more than that. Well, if we're really gonna try this, I've got a lot of reading to do to try and figure this out. And I shall keep your secrets. Mum's the word, Hunt. Very nice.
They say the Pacific Ocean has no memory, Hunter. But you are looking at the Atlantic. Really? Well, that explains so much. Just think. A few years ago, I was just your quintessential 98-pound high school freshman weakling. Even the lunch ladies used to shake me down for milk money. Now look at me. Hanging with the legendary Hunter and the Midnight Suns in their super-secret Atlantic Ocean base. We are happy to have you. That's just it. What if that radioactive spider had decided to chomp down on someone else's behind? What would old non-arachnid me be? Something tells me you would have changed the world regardless, Peter Parker. Changed the world? Let's not get carried away here. I may have helped out a bit in the neighborhood, but... You have certainly impacted me. Right back at you, pal. You know, Hunter, I've been to a lot of truly amazing places since I put on the old spider tights. Way beyond my little neighborhood in Queens. But when all is said and done, there is nowhere I'd rather be right now than here with the rest of you. Hunter, let's catch up. 